Okay, can you repeat that? Okay, well, fine. I don't want to be on the phone. That's fine. I'm the president of the Concord Farmers Market. People pay to be here. Yeah. And I've asked them kindly to leave. Okay. How about if I don't sell them? You can sit there all you want. You can't sell lemonade. Um, I haven't actually sold any lemonade yet. Well, you got to take your sign down. Well, where does it say that I'm selling it? Well, you're not a member of the Concord Farmers Market, so you don't legally have a right to be here. We rent the street we own it as a farmer's market association. So you vending whatever you're doing here is not according to the bylaws. Does it say that I'm vending all the time? I don't want to get... Just please, remove your things. I know what you're doing. You think it's funny, but it's not. It's not funny. It's in solidarity with all the children who have had to eliminate each other. Well, you can't vend it here, so please move. If you don't move, I'll move that stuff for you. How's that? So that's a threat. A threat to move your stuff off my street? Yes. Well, it's not illegal you're sitting here on the side, right? Well, with a sign saying lemonade, it implies you're selling lemonade, you have cups for distribution. Could you please just leave? I got a better idea. How about instead of selling lemonade, I'll sell memberships to the Lemonade Freedom Club. In which members... You're not allowed to vend at all on the street. What is vending by definition? That. That is vending. What is vending? Listen, I'm not going to get into. I'm not getting a little. This, I don't understand why you're being so unreasonable. How is it unreasonable to give away lemonade? Because you're doing it in, in my Concord Farmers Market. I'm the president. I'm the president. And we, not, we do not allow this type of stuff. You don't allow people to. You don't have a membership to the Concord Farmers Market. So you can't be here doing what you're doing. It's that simple. Okay. What if I, instead of... I don't want you to, I want you to stop talking. I don't want you to shut your damn carrying camera off, too. You just need to leave, please. Well, I'm not selling lemonade now. I'm filming a public event, so I'm acting as a member of the press. All right. Well, well don't get it out of here. Now you're shaking like a leaf because you're acting like an idiot. Yeah, because just I just got assaulted move. by you. I did not assault you. Did I touch you? No, I did not. You grabbed my property. Assault is. You grabbed I my property, which is in my hand. That's assault. I couldn't come grab that thing out of your no, hand. It's full of money. Yeah, whatever it's full of, it's not my right to touch. I think you need to leave. Well, you're on my street. I mean, you need to move your stuff. Now I'm just sitting All here. All right, I'm calling the police. Free lemonade, everybody. This has just turned into a free lemonade operation since that uh, man over there threatened to call the police. Free lemonade, everyone! Yes, it's all legal. Hush, you You can see a baby. Go on, what he said. He said. Do you want to ask him why he's like, serving so lemonade here? Is this the gentleman that spoke again? Yes. Okay. Yep. You want free lemonade? Is this not a public place? Not audio recording everybody, are you? Well, you have a right to since it's a public place. No, you don't. Yeah, you do. I have a copy of the wiretapping statute if you'd like to see it. No, I'm familiar with it, but thank you. Okay. You'd be wrong. Okay. Free lemonade, anyone? Thank you very much.
matter. You still can't. Um, I'm not going to arrest you for it today. Um, I remember you said you that know. once to Dave Ridley on camera. And... Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're right. I have. But I, I would have some concerns about you telling people they can't record. That's crazy. Uh, you're right. I have. I'm not going to arrest you for it today um, because I don't have to. Um, it's nice that you're giving away uh, lemonade. Uh, you might find that the city code comes by at some point and tells you that because you have food products and you're not licensed that they, you can't be here. Um, you can take that up with the code. Okay, even beverage gonna, products? Even beverage products. You can talk to the folks that run the uh, the farmer's market and uh, we'll go from there. So you might hear from, like I said, the uh, city code enforcement here at some point, just so you're aware. Interesting. All right, so en enjoy the lovely weather and uh, Hopefully somebody will take you up on your free lemonade, otherwise it looks like you'll be drinking a lot of lemonade. Nope. I've had some uh, nice people come by and get oh. some, a lot of kids. Good, good, yeah, I'm sure kids were very happy to have lemonade. Good. Like I said, we do get complaints from other private citizens that uh, they don't want to be audio recorded and you're audio recording them, then it's very likely we would arrest you at that point. Just so okay, and I would challenge that on the grounds that that is not a violation I, of the wiretapping I, statute. I have no idea. And I have the statute I, we can look at right I have, here. I don't know where you would challenge it or how that's a decision for a defense if you're arrested well the way it's challenged is it's on the basis of the definition of oral communication within the you statute can, listen it's and not it's something for you and i to discuss if you get arrested you can use that in court well so wouldn't you like to know though I, i'm already aware of it thank you all right here it is enjoy your afternoon and enjoy the nice weather okay you too Thanks. all right so i'll read the wiretapping statute into the camera here oral communication means any oral communication uttered by a person exhibiting an expectation that such communication is not subject to interception. So being as how we're in public right now, that is definitely not a violation of the wiretapping statute. Free lemonade. 